Welcome to the next in a series of DEC videos. This time we're going to look at one of DEC's key product lines, the DCS or Drum Containment System. The DCS was developed to cope with the challenging task of both loading drums at the start of your process and safely capturing completed products at the end of the process. Why is this so important? We consider this element of the pharmaceutical industry to be one of the most challenging. The DEC DCS solved this drum handling problem as it is simple, compact and will achieve containment levels below 1 microgram per cubic metre. This is something that other systems cannot achieve within the same footprint or without complex double chambers. For these reasons, the DCS continues to be the clear leader in both the pharmaceutical and chemical industries. The DCS handles all drum sizes, from plastic mousers to standard cardboard drums and steel drums. The benefit of the system is that it can be used to both empty drums, fill drums, meaning that it is extremely flexible. Unlike traditional isolators, the system has a small round isolator that is a key access point for the operator. Once the lid is removed from the drum, the drum can be transferred into the DCS. The operator then presses the integrated safety switches and lowers the isolator onto the drum. The drum is sealed onto the isolator, ensuring an airtight seal. The isolator contains all the safety HEPA filters and connections required for safe operation. This ensures the DCS is always under negative pressure to the outside environment. Because of this, it can be purged with inert gases if required. Operator access is achieved by using the two glove ports in the front of the unit with a waste bag out port mounted to the side of the system. DEC has worked very hard to keep the operation of the DCS very simple, as can be seen here. Before the drum is raised, a simple push ring is used to connect the outer primary bag in the drum. Then the outer liner is opened and the DCS glove box is lowered onto the drum. With the isolator in position, the operator removes the O-ring and removes the remaining O-ring from the previous charge and places them into the waste port. The new outer O-ring is pulled over the ceiling ring and it is fixed with a new O-ring. This allows the operator to pull the inner liner into the isolator where it can be opened safely. The operator then pulls the inner liner over the outer liner and connects it via a second O-ring making a double seal. The entire operation is completed under negative pressure. The operator can then move to the outside of the system and use the suction lance which is connected to a PTS to remove product from the bag. Once the drum is empty, the operator simply reverses the connection sequence. The inner liner connection O-ring is removed and the O-ring and push ring with the bag are discarded into the primary bag. The DCS is then raised using the integrated safety buttons with the outer liner still attached. The outer bag is then sealed using Lugaya safe seal system. The new seal connection film is attached below the glove box, ensuring full containment. Then the safe seal containment system is cut. This separates the liner from the DCS unit. The drum lid is placed on the drum and the drum is then removed from the system and it is ready for its next charge. However, this is not the end of the benefits of a DCS as it can also be used as a filling system. Naturally, the system can fill into drums of all sizes by virtue of the variable height connection system. Also, as drums come with double line bags, the DCS connection system is ideal for fully contained drum loading as we've seen previously. The system operation is simple. Firstly, a drum is connected into the system above the hopper or silo, or indeed fed from one of our own PTS feeder systems or a transbatch feeder. The DCS is a major system application for the handling of powder in drums, both into a system and out from a system. It benefits from being simple to operate, flexible as it can handle a variety of drum sizes, it is operator friendly, it achieves less than one microgram per cubic meter over an eight hour working day, operates with low cost components, can achieve accurate filling and dosing, Fully CIPable, it has a small footprint and can be linked to other deck products, including the lump breaker, transbatch, 
and PTS filler. DECA produce hundreds of these systems and they are in use in many facilities around the world with almost all of the major pharmaceutical and chemical manufacturers. DEC really have thought through all of the technical challenges that exist with loading and unloading highly toxic products from drums. The DCS combines many of the powder transfer technologies associated with the DEC group, giving you the customer the confidence that DEC can safely handle your toxic products and keep all your staff safe and increase your bottom line. DEC really does give you powder handling excellence for the pharmaceutical and chemical industries. See you next time on Biz2Biz TV.